Hi guys, Crafty Max here. Uh, today I have a haul to share for you. I did a lot of shopping and I have a lot of things to show you, so let's get started. First place I went to was Tiger Store, and this is their very funky bag. They're a Swedish or Danish shop that sells kind of like funky knickknacks. Okay, first thing I got were napkins. So they're one euro each, was a really good deal. So there's this mushroom napkin set. You get 20 and they're 33 by 33 centimeters when folded out. So this mushroom set, and I like the pops of lime green. The next one is this really geometric design with the wood grain, the teal, the pink, the white, and the black. And again, these were one euro each, was a really good deal. So there's 20 napkins again. So these are the designs. Second thing I got was this canvas. It's 21 by 15 centimeters, which is a good size. And it's really cheap and you get the corner reinforcers with it. And I just didn't have any canvases that size and I kind of like working in this size. So I just got it. The, I got frames as well. Um, this is 10 by 15 centimeters and this is 15 by 15 centimeters. Yeah, they're just normal frames. Um, I like the design. It's black and this one is orange, which is really, I don't know, different. So, for framing little things, I always need frames. Do you want you? I also got these twin markers set and I couldn't, these are the only ones I could find. There were two yellow packs and one blue. So I got them and they're really good markers. I think I'll be doing a review on them soon. So basically you get two th tips, one thinner tip and one like angled brush. Pretty standard on all markers. So anyway, I got color. Yellow, it's color 41, 44, and 47. And they're square, which I don't, I don't really mind. And they're really cheap, like one, 3 euro for the whole set, which is 1 euro marker. And other markers can come up to like 7 euro each. And I also got the blue set. Like, blue turquoise. So there's 11, 14, and 17. And you can get a ton of different colours, except I went to two stores, but they didn't have any more, which is kind of sad. I'd have bought them. Next thing I got was this big brush. It was three euros, and I have been looking for a big brush, but they've always been super expensive. So I just got it um, for watercolour, you know, small brushes sometimes just don't work. So I got that. It's pretty long. It's like, okay, it's like 12 inches long, 30 centimeters. So I got that. That's all I got from Tiger. Next thing I got was this Uniball Signo Broad White Marker. Um, do I have any black cards? No, no. I'm just gonna. It's really opaque. So that's how it is on blue paper, and I really like it. Um, yeah, for like adding snow onto watercolor, because I'm going to make Christmas cards this year. So I thought I'd get that. Next thing I got was this felting wool. It's by the brand Rayher. Um, 50 grams. It's this kind of dark brown color. It also has some different colors weaved in. So I'm gonna make, got this for making dogs. It was five euro which is, I don't know, it's not too bad for like such a big pack I guess. Sorry about the wrinkle. Next thing I got was wool. So I got yellow, one thing yellow and it's three for two so I got nine balls all together. Um, 
first day I went about these. They weren't the same color, so I had to go back and get more. And then I just got yellow. I'll use them, but they're just not the same color as the normal ones. So, anyway, this is Knitting Essentials. Taupe and taupe and neon yellow. Shade 79, then yellow and shade... I don't know what shade this is. Um, shade 218. So... That's that, just throwing them on the floor. The next thing I got was this Felt Dogs book by Mitsuki Hoshi. And it shows you how to make adorable needle felt dogs. So I'll just go quick through it. It's instructions and it's absolutely adorable. Here are some of the dogs you can make. And everybody loves the dogs. <laughs> They're great. I'll make them for my family as gifts. And yeah. It was like 13 euros, I think. Here are the next things I got. One more thing. The next thing I got was this Happy Christmas stamp set by Inca Stamp, apparently. It was five euro and I was looking for dyes except I couldn't find a Merry Christmas one, which was the one I wanted. It's a rubber stamp, yeah. Next thing I got was this Dovecraft clear stamp and this is the item number if you wanted. It's handmade and handmade by. So I just got it, made in UK, it was 130, which is not bad for two stamps I guess. Next thing I got were these sunflower stamp sets. Um, I really have always been looking for a big flower stamp set, they're by Papermania Signature. Build a sunflower and sunflower burst, sunflower burst, build a flower. That's, those are the item numbers. And you get just the big flowers, and this you can layer flowers. It's not like the ones you have to cut them out separately, these ones. So you just got a lot of them. They're 3 euros, but now they're 2 euros, so I just got them. Such a good deal. Next thing I got was the Lawn Fawn Chit Chat stamp set, which is my first Lawn Fawn stamp set. I'm so happy. It was 17.30, which is bit of money for stamp sets, like quite a lot, but you get so many stamp sets and sentiments. This happy birthday, feel better soon, miss you, thinking of you, thanks, make a wish, hi there, love, congrats, and of course you've the adorable birds. I'm going to be playing with this sooner, I hope. So that's basically everything of my haul. I'll just put them on the table. Like that. So I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Thanks for watching.